Hi you guys. My name is Dr. Leah Taylor. I am an integrative mental health specialist and super passionate about speaking, researching, and teaching people how to use live music as medicine. So today I wanted to come to you with just a super simple breath technique that you can use for anxiety, for worry, for fear, whenever you begin to feel a little activation in your nervous system, which means that your sympathetic nervous system is being activated. We call it fight or flight. It is telling your body that there is something wrong, that it needs to be on alert. But this isn't the way that we want to be in life because our immune system, our digestive system, all of our systems work best when we are more relaxed and calm. So if there is an immediate threat out there and you need to run as fast as you can or get prepared to fight, then the system is really good to have kicked on. But most of the time, it's just a perceived threat either in our mind or something that we perceive in the environment to be dangerous. It's not actually an, an immediate threat at that time. Um, especially right now, there's so much fear and anxiety and worry going on right now that uh, this breath technique can be very useful all the time. So this is what you do. You're going to breathe in through your nose for four counts and then out through your mouth for six counts. So a normal deep breath count is five and five, but what we wanna do is actually accentuate the out breath and do it through our mouth. So that turns on the parasympathetic branch of the autonomic nervous system, which tells our body that it's okay to calm down. So it's kind of like a back door into letting the body calm down that we don't even need to use our mind for. Um, and when we calm the body down, it will also calm the mind down as well. So that's actually called a bottom up technique. So we're using the body to communicate with the mind, to let it know, to tell the whole system to calm down that everything's gonna be okay. <sighs> All right, sighing is also really helpful too because as you can see, we're doing it through our mouth and it's longer than our inhale. So let's go ahead and take like three breaths that inhales through the nose and then just an exhale sigh just to kind of get on the same breath count so inhale and two more in and one more letting go of anything that you want to release and then we'll inhale for four and exhale for six And inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. So that's three. Let's go for two more in. Great. And then just taking a moment to notice how you feel. So you may feel more calm, you may feel more relaxed, more grounded, more settled in your body. Um, those are usually the sensations that people feel. I know for myself, I feel more calm and grounded. Um, so this technique can be super simple to use. It's with your breath, which you have with you all the time. You don't need to bring anything extra with you. You don't need to pay for anything extra. You always have it. But the important thing to remember is this works really fast, but it doesn't last for that long. It only lasts for as long as you can keep yourself calm. So as soon as you have another thought or another thing from the environment that comes in to tell you that your body may be under threat, your sympathetic nervous system is gonna kick back in. So at that point, you need to do this breath again so that you can calm yourself down. So that's the most important part to keep in mind. It doesn't like save itself up and last for hours or anything like that. You have to keep doing it over and over again but that's okay because it's your breath and you have to be breathing anyway. So you may as well use it so that it is helpful for you. So I hope that this has been helpful for you. 
Um, I know I use it all the time. I teach it to my son who's nine. It's part of our bedtime routine. I want to make sure that he knows that he can use this at any time. So feel free to teach it to your family, your friends, your neighbors, anybody else. I use this breathing technique um, as a mind-body technique more than any others with my patients that I work with at work, uh, which is in integrated pain care. And uh, again, I use it for myself and my family too. So hopefully it's useful for you. Lots of love to everybody. Stay safe out there and keep breathing.